You can go back sooner. You can make it happen. Detailed.
How you doing tonight, Jeff? So Star Citizen, uh, Space Sim, still in development, but uh, like I said, I can try and play some uh, new player missions, ones I normally don't play. Normally I just do the bunker and some cargo running, but uh, I'm going to try some of the low levels to see what people do that don't know much about the game and where they would get started. And Because uh, a lot of people have new player guides and stuff like that, because games are sandbox. So, you know, if, if it's it's not going to really they do have a, a new player experience, so to speak, at this location here. So if you start it'll, when you log into the game, it'll ask you to play the tutorial. It's a very basic tutorial. It kind of gives you an idea what to do, but there's a lot more in this game to do than just that. And uh, as they keep adding things, uh, it's kind of hard to kind of keep everybody up on it. And uh, how you doing tonight, jokes? So I'm going to run, like I say, run some of the lower level stuff. Uh, try and clear out this log right here and kind of. Uh, I'm, I'm starting on this location here. Usually I've been on the other side at a lower level. I'm going to start at New Babbage. It's a little more scenic and uh, easier to see where you're going. So a little bit different experience. Plus there's more players on this side of the map too. Or the, say this side of the universe. Uh, probably about an hour, uh, you know, maybe do a bunk or two, maybe do some farming, not a whole lot, because uh, I think they show that they're going to have um, the new content for uh, when the uh, Chinese New Year drops, and they show the armor already, so let's see if I can find that, but I saw uh, Cyric had it up on his stream, so looks pretty cool, and uh, yeah, I'll put a little bit after this, huh? It's maybe an hour on this, maybe an hour and a half, and then we'll take and hop over to the uh, last day on Earth. This game, uh, you can get into this game for roughly, uh, I would say at the most, 45. Uh, if they've got it on sale, because basically you have to buy a starter ship, and um, that's pretty much all you need to get started in the game. And everything else, you can... Uh, earn the money to uh, buy bigger ships uh, as they take and put into the game. So everything in the game, you'd be able to uh, grind it out and uh, buy them. So, but yeah, maybe the most at the most 45 out of your pocket. Sometimes they may have a deal, they get it for 35 for the cheaper ships. But uh, if you look at, if you go to their site, RSI or Robert Space Industries, uh, and look at their, what does say for the uh, ships, most people tell you to start with an Aurora or like a Titan Defender, or even a Cutter. Uh, the Cutter's kind of all around. It's not a combat ship, but you can do, you can get you around. You can do most of like a cargo missions and stuff like that, exploration. But the Defender will be a very basic, let you do a little bit of everything more, especially with ship to ship combat, PVP, that sort of thing, so. But like I said, they're still developing it, but it's in a better shape than it's been in years. Uh, and hopefully this year they're expecting to do even more things that maybe it'll be a household name and not just like a niche thing that people see and don't know what it is. Gonna be doing after this. So yeah, the armor looks really good. Yeah, that uh, the the armor I saw that when when he had when Osiris had that photo of it. I'll make sure I can uh, pick that up. I'm kind of hoping it's gonna have some kind of stats or something to it, like that previous armor that they did that had the uh, damage. Uh, barrier on it but uh we'll see that's what i and make your own show yeah <laughs> yeah pretty much pretty much yeah like i said they've got a list it, it does have a lot to it but like i said it can be um rather confusing if you don't really if you like stuff that's not going to hold your hand and it's non-linear, this is what this game is. Like if you play World of Warcraft, even though it's it's pretty much linear, although you can you don't have to do the main storyline or whatever. Uh, there's really no main storyline with this game. 
It's kind of like factions. Uh, you got your the players. You got nine tails, which is kind of like the the uh, CD side of the universe. And then you got the car. Uh, Van Duel, which are these uh, uh, alien race that uh, haven't you see their ships, but you haven't really run into them just yet. So most people won't see them until they release the single player version of it's called Star Citizen. Uh, no, Squadron 42. Sorry, Squadron 42. And once they release that, that's going to give you more of a story background for what this uh, open world uh, game is supposed to be uh, based off of. But we don't know when they're going to release Squadron 42. It may be next year. Uh, they could surprise people and do it this year because they said the game was, was complete. Or would they say feature complete? And uh, they were just doing the final polishes on it. And however long that takes, uh, whenever they're ready, they're going to release it. So, but you know, they're going to try and time it so it doesn't uh, come out when uh, GTA 6 comes out because, you know, a lot of people are going to be playing that. So they want to have as much uh, FaceTime with the public and not have to split it with any other big AAA companies. It's got bigger games that people are waiting on. So, you know, let's see. I'll get this game to get paid next week. Okay, cool. Now there's a ton of uh there's a ton of creators on YouTube um that will have a lot to do to you know explain a lot of details. If you do two new player guides, star citizen, you'll see a ton of them pop up online, especially on YouTube. And some can go in real detail uh, explaining the ins and outs of the game. I'm going to do a bunker first, so I don't need a crazy ship. I like to get there pretty quickly. And my favorite ship to get there quickly is the 350R, which is basically a racer. But it's got enough weapons on it, so if you do run into something, you can uh, get out of trouble. We are in hangar four. to do uh, evaluation so basically I am doing what you would call a new player quest over here but to get these other ones to open up and I do not like these monitors uh, they're not really new player friendly at all it's 890 jump you know we're going to take that We're going to go here and see if we can successfully get our, uh, basically get our stripes to start getting more uh, higher paying bunker quests. Complete this one here pretty easily. So we'll shall see. I think I know this game isn't like you're in space and there's like guilds that fight against each other or is that something else? Uh, now there's a game called Elite Dangerous. Uh, when you say gills, uh, Star Citizen has uh, orcs, but they don't necessarily fight against each other. There's no controlling territory thing like that in the game as of now. Uh, you do have people that group up to do a lot of the quests. Uh, it's easier for multiplayer. And you will find videos where different organizations have organized uh, battles and fight against other uh, works but those are those are planned things it's not something that the game uh, is really set up to do yet where you're trying to control territory and all that uh, eve online is more like that but it's not it's gonna be more 
Eyes to Tomic the view. Like you you're gonna see the ship from the outside view on Evo Online pretty much the whole time. Whereas on this game right here, you can get in and out of the ship. Anywhere you see on a planet, you can fly down to it and land. Um it's like I said, when it's working well, there's nothing else out there that compares to this game. But like I said, they're still, you know, putting it together. But, uh, you know, right now, everyone kind of sees that they have uh, have put a lot into it. And uh, those that have been sticking to it are kind of appreciative of it. Now, why? I'm... There we go. Let's reset my throttle. I can't be all one that's scared of space. <laughs> Uh, after it, at the end of the day, jokes, it's a, it's just a video game. Uh, now, it can be frustrating. You know, you don't want to be losing. Um, you don't want to be losing things that you find. Um, that's why it's going to reverse there for a minute. But uh, some people call this probably the prettiest uh, screenshot. Um, game around as far as pictures and stuff. Like I said, they're still working on getting more content into it. Uh, they're trying to get this thing called a replication layer working. So they they their dream is to have ten thousand players in this game all at the same time, and everyone able to interact. Because right now. There's only like uh, at the most a hundred players per server, and they want to get those where the servers all work together. And like I say, you, like I say, you can have with ten grand, or how many as many as they want on there, and all around the world, and everybody can take and play and interact with each other. So that's their main, that's their ultimate goal uh, that they're trying to achieve. Yes, they do. Yeah. Yes, they do. And I'm going to I'm going to say that it is, but it's not really not really winning. Um, maybe you're not grinding out as much because it's easy enough to make the money in this game. Uh, like I said, you don't have any NPCs outside of the nine tails that you're dealing with. So it's not as pay to win as some people say, like, like. You're not going to have the advantage. You may have the advantage as far as farming, um, maybe having better ships, but eventually everyone gets that get the same ships. It's not like um, my ships can be a better geared one. If the same, if the ships are equal, they're the same. Uh, components could be different, but you know, eventually everybody can get the components too. So it's just a matter if you don't have the time, just like anything else, if you don't have the time to grind out or spend, you know, eighty hours. <laughs> a week or a full time on these things. That's that's basically what it is. You know, I'm gonna spend 170 on last day on Earth. <laughs> yeah, last day on Earth is probably more of that one for sure. Uh, the fact that I'm so used to only seeing Moon and Sun, if you to see another planet, right now I'd be so scared. Right, if you got a telescope, you can sit out there, especially at night, and see. Pretty much every planet in our solar system right now. I mean, may never get to me in your lifetime, but it's nothing to be uh, worried about on that. All right, let's see if we can find this place. With the jump QT drive warmed up. And we are above 10,000 planet, so we can jump to it once we find it and size up, line up the, uh, make sure we get it right because it's nestled in between stuff. I just now realized something. I need to go back to Microtech. At least take and hover over it. 
There we go. Let's see it from here. Sovereign space for making a new type. Try chicken flavored 10 times out of 10. Now choose chicken. Really? Making a new type of fried chicken flavor. 10 times out of 10, I'll choose chicken. That's funny. Rogue planets? What do you mean? No, don't can't say that I've heard of those before. Hmm. Someone told me rogue planets with the description, I would think large meteors or maybe a chunk of a planet that from when it exploded and it's still on the trajectory from when it was launched into space. solar system and head towards us there's nothing we can do it's true that's true feel like they've um, changed the flight model. Yeah, it's not flying straight like it used like it did before prior to change something. Face the same as well. I uh, know space, ocean. Still don't know much. We don't know anything about the ocean. I was talking about space. All right, let me see. Once I get into, there we go. See, can we still hover? Because they're going to remove this feature here, but it looks like this wants to drop out the sky. We may just take him lay in. You'll be the first man to stand on Mars. In school, get those grades up. You have a goal, work towards it. Maybe the first one to uh, stand on Mars one day. I 
gonna look just outside the city. Cause I forgot my gear. For now, we can steal what was within the uh, armistice zone of the city. We can still access our inventory. Will not be the case for too long. If I fought a planet, it better explode because I ain't holding back. Why would you want to fight a planet? All right, let's take in. Maybe they did take in. Oh, okay. They may have changed that. Just be as long as you're within that little satellite icon and that no bullet icon, you could still access your inventory at the location. But it looks like that's changed. Or has been updated. Or maybe I need to get closer into the city. Appreciate that, Jeff. Now, let me see if I can find in the air, the uh, space station, or should I say the airport is always a challenge. There it is. Do I have a torque imbalance? My ship was is flying as if it was damaged. I am currently headed back to get some gear, but I seem to be having a problem with the ship. It's flying like it's damaged or something like there's a. Uh, 
it's not getting full power to the engine for some odd reason. Which is confusing unless maybe I start the game with the uh, I'm about to take you and reset my uh, flight stick. This is one of the bigger ships that they have in the game right now, though. This reclaimer here, so you get to take a peek at this. I wish it was more daytime out here, though. I just want to set it down. There we go. So I guess we have to be closer than we were before. All right. Now, a different helmet. Second weapon. Oh, it's gonna be a best nine. Let's try on this. Need another. I 
do not have is ammo. So I wish this inventory could be separated. Arms, chest, legs, backpacks. That way you're not doing this number, just scrolling, scrolling, scrolling to you. Find what you're looking for. Now we're going to have to put inside ammo. Another hour, another hour. If it gets too close, I'll just cut it short. Switch over to uh, last day. So if you could, outside of that, what do you want to see about him? Oh, somebody left a tank out here.
guess they, they got it or decide to leave it. Oh, I see. That would be pretty cool. Verify it. That it's not all made up. Have you kept up with the uh, rover that they have over there? The photos and stuff that they is sent back. I think the last time I checked on it, they were showing it was down to its last little bit of battery life. tower I need to land and get some ammo yes but you didn't take and light up anything there we go if this thing needs to be repaired nope. maybe it looks like I started on my uh, start the game my controller for it kind of amazing how he's back in thing that exists mm. the Empire's 
Let's see if this will take you to reset this ship. So I'll find some armor, the ammo. Never had fried chicken before? Just uh, baked and broiled? Now, to be fair, Jeff, uh, depending on where you are, uh, McDonald's and Burger King, yes, they can be good, but we all know about the food. Some places outside of the U.S. where I am, uh, they have uh, not too fond of those fast food chains. No, I will tell you, they are tasty. What's in what's in them? How they're how the uh, the processing? It's the processing. A lot of places they don't take in um, additives and preserves. They don't do that with their food. So just depending on where you are, what you're used to, and the different tastes. The patron standing on the steps. Yeah, I mean, like I said, it depends. I've seen some places where they've run out 
uh, certain fast food places because they don't they don't want the processed food because they kind of know. I, I still think you know it's moderation, right? Um, not all of them, just certain ones. They don't strictly want any of those fast food restaurants around. Oh, you just never, never had it. Okay. You can see that. It's like starting over again because it's first time I've been here in Lorville. I know exactly where to go. I know where the ship components are here, but I've not gone to where you get ammo and armor. Let's say that's for a vehicle, but it says personal. Right, let's see. Read the signs as if you were in a real city. What are they going to say? Is that personal weapon? So let's see. Hey, got those, but do we have. search thing in so I can't type in the ammo that I need but they do sell the gun that I want so just need the ammo and the search thing is not working or it's not showing Or did they change this also? Also, here I just don't see any ammo. Let's see, there we go. That's what I was looking for. FS9. Since we can't type it in to search for it. Now let's head back. I'll go make pizza with ketchup, mayo, sausage, and stuff like that. Never had a pizza in my life. What do you need ammo for? Is there like enemies you can find? Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, uh, I took and changed my location from what I've been playing for since I've been playing this game. And the only time I've come over here is to get uh, uh, ship 
weapons and parts, but I've never come over here to get any personal ammo for my guns. And it's first time I was over here doing that. So like I wasted a lot of time. I'm sure there's another location, but I can go look for it. Now we're going to head back to the spaceport. Probably get a different ship. Cause I don't know what's going on with the, um, 350. It was not flying well at all. Back chokes. Welcome back, Joe. You wish. See, the thing about this game, like I say, they it's pretty much it almost feel like you're walking around a real city, waiting on trains and stuff until you get into your own ship and even the travel time. Not the instant teleporting. Oh, you wait. I can't. If that inventory will. Nice. Now, there's other things that we need, but I'm going to see if I can get them from the location I'm going to. Medical stuff, drink, water, substance of the say as my character gets thirsty or hungry. Take about 30 on each. And you said it was my 88, but I'll take and go through that as I. Uh, Run through these. Biggest part, let's see if the ship will function as intended. We should go back in time and play first time it came out because it looks more fun than this now. Not really. I'll say that uh, if it seems slow now, it was actually slower than uh, when they first started out. They really didn't put a whole lot out. And they have some really cool events that they haven't brought back. I'll say that much for sure. That's why I say I just, if they just left all the events, um, in game as they brought them out, there would be tons to do all the time. And like I say, I still say they need to get rid of the uh, energy costs. So if you wanted to keep running around, you could. I know what's wrong. Did not equip the components for my ships. The guy they took and had the uh, hatch, which usually resets your ships to default. No. The components I have in this thing. Yeah, they have, like I said, the, the stuff that they got now, like the story modes that they uh, recently did. Now, those are new. Those are pretty cool. Uh, and like I said, they 
like I said, they're piecemealing the story out. So there wasn't a whole lot of backstory at the beginning. It was pretty much you were just playing the game, literally just playing it. Didn't have any rhyme or reason for what you were doing. So when they come out with these uh, story modes, it does kind of get you like, OK, so now you guys are putting the story into it and uh, trying to explain what's going on and all that. Um, but that left that stuff in there and left the things that they had originally. Uh, you'd be you'd be playing for hours, even more than you do now. Of its top components. Power plant is not what I want. This QT drive, definitely don't want that. Definitely don't want these shields. Want these shields. And I hope this should fix what's going on. All right, so we got all the new components that I use, I'm used to flying with. We don't want this. We want the Panther, the Peters. Kept all, kept all my stuff. Okay, cool. A lot of people lost some of their components and ships. It's not as bad as it used to be, but no. See, what was the best event? Man, what was the best event? I, I'm going to say the best event was like, say, when the this last thing when they did this story mode, they've had one before that. All the story modes are like pretty much my favorite because they give you something to look forward to on the next one. Uh, you know, a lot of times they don't put everything out there at once. After two weeks, you get part of it. Another two weeks, you get the rest of it. And then the last two weeks, you know, wraps it up. So for me, uh, those those story modes, those are pretty cool. I mean, they don't really, they don't really have any bad events. Um, but the story mode that they take and throw in, those are pretty cool. I hate it when they finally, when they leave. Yeah. Yeah, Genesis. Well, like I say you had a story mode before you got the Genesis. They were hinting at it. Uh, they kept talking about New New Haven. This was before uh, they brought in the uh, even the uh, harbor, the port, the port harbor, or whatever. The, the, the laboratory is that because at first you just had the harbor there, uh, and they didn't they had the thing that looked like the lab, but it wasn't even open yet. So that part of it was pretty cool at the time. All right, let's see if this thing will see if it fixed itself. Since I got the components, I actually like one in it. That's why I'm hoping that we'll finally get new Genesis and I hope we get the helicopter. Like I said, I didn't got much left to take and reveal and then it just had to come up with new stuff for the game. Oh. Uh, best event, Genesis, yeah, deliver oh, deliveries, yeah, deliveries though, oof, uh, I wish I could automate that, I don't really, not one of my favorite things to be doing, I like the rewards from it though, okay, let's see, let's see, that fixed the ship because now we have proper power and we're getting above 300. So now it's flying like it should. What is it with the outside view? Some bug or something. This should not be messing with outside. That's got to be a bug. Going to the outside view reduces your throttle. But it's flying better now.
What's your favorite gun and melee weapons? I have a cobalt and the cleaver. My favorite melee is the machete and the VSS, even though the VSS is not best for every situation. I just like the VSS with the damage that it puts out. And obviously I think everyone's going to say that the, um, um, Oh, I'm drawing a blank. What's the high powered one? They're adding a new watchtower to a new location that you need to grind for or to the helicopter. Then when you finish help card, you fly to a whole new country or something. Hmm. Would not put it past them for doing that. All right, let's not black out. Day conscious. To the other side of the planet. Coordinates lock in. Off we go. See what it does when it's QT and does it do it? And my zooming out is not working either. So maybe they changed something on that. The Winchester. I, I, I don't know if to say jokes. I, 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 <laughs> Winchester. Maybe it'll grow me one day, but right now it's not. Now, my question is. Do I have to land outside of this or can I land right next to it? Are you talking about for the pistol? Yeah, but that was in there for a hot minute. And it's a good question why they removed it. say so anytime there's something that may give the player an advantage in the game usually it doesn't stay too long oh, base is not base is not shooting at me yet okay cool they're in friendly territory. Down right here on the outside. This is Lamar Jackson. Every time keep, I keep thinking about this football player, and I know that's not who you're referring to. All right, let's take in. Okay. 
an ammo set for that and then FS9 in case we get after taking go loud as they say let's go laser work Got about microtech in the cold. If Bunker Charlie doesn't have five new guns, five new LA, my new mechanics because I'm getting an AK 47. Two make hits. I mean, Chris, we can agree that it's going to be hard. Yes, it is. It's going to be probably the worst grind. Since they haven't mentioned any other vehicles, this is probably gonna be the worst grind of every of any vehicle in this game. It's going to be the worst grind. That much you can be assured on that. All right, that's eight hostels left. And we're coming in on the top floor. Downstairs. Angle. One. Yeah, we are now. It's on the freeway. is lagging really bad. Heavy. Need you to get a bead on me. Dude. Guys are not want to go down. Uh, so there's two. E they're all downstairs? Yes, they're all downstairs. Good. Those. Uh oh. What you need, let's see. My prediction on what we are going to need for how we're going to need those circles. Or as I forget the name. Oh, that, yeah. You know, that's going to be part of it. Because they hadn't put that in the game yet. So I'm quite sure that when they do bring it up, that, they're finally going to bring that final ore that we need. You know, peak. Peak. My mouse is not responding to this at all. That's the last one. And all you guys did not make it. I think you guys have any ammo that I need. No, you don't. But you do have the med pens. I need those. A lot of engines. Yeah, gonna need a ton of engines. That, that's for sure. Parts. A lot of probably a lot of the rubber components, um, probably a bunch of the, the wire, uh, electronic components too. I'm sure all that's going to be probably astronomical. They may be, they may even do like a two tier, like the first stuff you need just to get the blueprint, like they did with the boat and put it down. And then you had to complete it once you got that part done. It's like two tiers to finish that. It's going to be a grind. That much, you know, it will be a grind. The problem is, though, I hope it's not like the not going to be limited. Like it's going to be another gas guzzle like the ATV and you can only only use it sparingly. That's the only thing I'm going to dread. It takes you like three months to put it together. Three months to put together and you can only take it to one location. It's not what I want to experience with that. All right. Do I have 
the med stuff. Let's tell him like it's one. Make a look. What's the that's supposed to be the I'm I'm sure that that what's um uh, what is it? Um I'm almost positive that's what uh Genesis is gonna be. Location that you'll be going to for that very thing. I'm sure it's all gonna tie up there and maybe they'll bring you know, add some other stuff then. I don't know what. I still like to say I hope that uh, even if they had that when they open up that uh, ore rig, that you'll either fly there and or be able to take and uh, use your uh, boat to drive over there too on the river. I hope it's not just a oh the only place you can, you can only use your boat to get there. That part I don't want. Get some options with the other vehicles that we have. No, they're never going to do that because remember they're going to they're going to still. I'm quite sure the helicopter is going to be something that's kind of beaten up, barely can fly or you know, barely get it going. It would be cool if it was something that you found at a military base that was uh, cabbage or something. That uh, that would be pretty cool, which is probably where you had that uh, that last set of armor that they've got. So. Maybe that's where they're going to tie it all together. Don't know. You can almost see it, though. I don't think there's head pins. Got one multi tool. Multi tool, but I don't have a battery for it. Battery here. Multi tool never go rating without it. Plus, I'm waiting for them to just have a whole section of the map opened up that's just as large as the current one that we have. Like, do it, you know, surprise and do it all at one time. But here you guys go. We can chew on this for the next year or two. It's giving me so much to do. Cause they've got all the components that they if, like I said, if they put everything that they've had in the game all the events in the game over the years since it started and then just and add the locations they they would have enough to uh open up another section of the map now i ain't talking about the crater I don't, I don't even care about the crater Now, what would you use the railgun for? Like maybe bosses or something. Okay, that's that's new. R is not putting the gun away, but it's bringing out a pan. He conquer other planets, <laughs> destroying ships. Ah, okay, destroying ships. They Charlie, oh, oh. alphas and weapons, bravos like chemicals lab, muscle chemicals. What would Charlie be? Yeah, but Charlie's supposed to be more like a green zone. I don't think they're going to turn around and make it hostile. I mean, it could be like, say, if you're talking about New Genesis and that's where they may be all located. They can go over there and um, I know. Excite on Daemon. All right, let's go do this one if it's still up. 
that one I say one way to finish your thing so get this done and we'll take in uh, if I don't get flattened and hop over the last hill on earth Yeah, so, that, so that'd be a good thing. Yeah, yeah. Bunker Charlie is a green zone. So hopefully, it's like I say, it's, it's going to give you uh, quests or other missions to talk to other NPCs there. <laughs> Gordon, select a location, you can go clear and get some else. Yeah, that'd be cool. I mean, they've had stuff similar to that. Yeah, there's something going on there. Time you switch the view, it's uh, killing the throttle. But that would be cool if they uh, had it, and you got a lot of quest NPCs. To find locations that only those NPCs can give you the coordinates to. Maybe they're timed or something like that. Yo, you in the jet. Still out for all those random bunker cards. Yes. See, that's another one. All those cards, right, was supposed to give you access to the very bunkers that now uh it's like i don't know why we didn't they didn't give us any of their cards to collect so if you didn't have the code you just carried kept, you know brought the card with you or something like that t18 is stress so i need to uh, jump point not you Something. Hi. Uh, there we go. I need an only point. From the other side of the planet. Gonna jump to five. Yes, it does. Like I say, you know, I don't think that's like I said, that's why people keep playing it because you know, it's also the fact, like I said, I played, I played the game um, Jurassic Park, or well, not Jurassic Park, but it was Jurassic Survival. And that game had a lot of the components from this one in it. Oh, I can't take and jump to it for this under 12. Um, there's a lot of stuff in that game that I wish they they would bring over to LDL um, last in there because the arena event that they have now there was a better version of it where you would go in there and you had a it's almost like a mini BR you had to and they had buildings and stuff you know single floor buildings you would go in pick up weapons and stuff like the regular like the BRs you play now and. pick up the weapons like you do now arm your character and then you had to go and find uh, NPCs throughout the map because originally you thought that they were really players but they're just NPCs and it was just basically if you take everybody out you got a good decent reward for it uh, that's an event that I wish they would bring over the last standard but they not doesn't seem like they have any intention of bringing that over here to jump I 
land in the hangar, but we're not going to do that. This could be a mistake. Oh, so I'm not going to blow my ship up before I even get out of it. So long, ship. Now, I hope that the other ship is still going to be here. Because my ride just got rocketed. And I may not be able to leave. Come on, EVA. Get it together. There it goes. enough ammo for this. It's right there. By the way, these guys. They shoot me through this glass. I'm not gonna be happy. Well, y'all got that special armor. And he's behind the glass. I can't hit him. I don't want to come down and chase you either. the two of us see if that glass will protect me or you can shoot through it a lot of time y'all can shoot through it There's only six of them left? Okay. To the bridge then.
All right, let's take the elevator. They're never gonna nerf the right the the, the shields on those guys. That would most definitely help if they did. Can't shoot over top of this? Because it enclosed. for the last three that were here. Oh, we got three of these guys to try and track down. Nope. It's going to be at the hangar, I'm sure. Okay, we're out crew deck. Engineering already. already here so I need to get to front of the ship Outside corner, so we could give you a lot of guns and armor. Now, see the alien part. Like I said, they had that. They had that set for that early on. Elevators are broken, dude. Uh, oh, there we go. We want the hanger. If it'll work. Just keep going around because you don't want to seem to work unless I'm already here. All right, this should be the medical. Okay, so I am at the hangar. That's medical. That's three guys hiding at. That'll be my ride out of here. Two to five. This is why you have a silencer, a suppressor on your guns. It kind of works, kind of works both ways. On one, they can't find you because they can't hear your gun discharge. But the same token, if you don't have a suppressor on, they're going to run to the noise and it's easier to wait for them to show up.
open sesame okay so there's nothing there two to go where would these last two be Eight chamber. Doubt they're gonna be in there. So where would you where'd the last two be? Back here. Out in the for you. Chin. Now that's that crew member. What do you want the devs to add into the game? Hmm. Well, everything they've got right now, I want to see the I want to see the city. Uh, they they teased about a city. The the suburbs is one thing, but that's supposed to lead to a um, bigger city. And I don't think I've ever seen any um, information about that. They talked about it, but I had seen it. Oh, pool, draw, second floor. What I want to, what I, you know, what? Here's a good one. They had a they had a teaser video years ago that showed multiple floors. Uh, for your bases and um, I would like for them to take and make that a reality so you can have multiple floors on your bases because the video that they had showed it I hate these invisible glass doors yeah. now he's looking at me And there's one left to find. Yeah, they had, um, you can have multiple uh, floors. And uh, that much I do want to see that. Okay, are we done? That should be everything. I'm going to take that 300 out of here. They avoid inflicting. Well, they're all done. So, cool. All right, so this mission is done. Uh, the planet. But yeah, I want to see that. Multiple floors. So it was spreading out all the time. Have it where we're um, going up to like two or three levels with our uh, bases. No, they can do it. I mean, the whole point of that, what was it? Uh, like even the settlement right now. The point that they, the, the fact that they have you going up around the ramp on the uh, gate, like that's the only place that you're doing that. So why not have it where you can have your base? You, they can do it. It's not that difficult. Now I'm saying that, you know, not knowing the code, but that's something that's, that's, that's doable. So like I say they advertise it. it. You know, if you've seen the video, they were advertising it like, oh yeah, you're going to be taking uh like build your base up and have a different type of uh, fences and stuff like that. That was, that was a thing that actually existed. The whole thing about the mortar, I just want to know what that's going to be used for, because if you're not going to be using it, cause there's no PVP in um, the single player area. It's only over in the multiplayer and it doesn't seem like they're going to have that, uh, that gear. Well, 
they're going to have you doing PvP against other players on the single player game. So if anything, it's almost like that's going to be used for heavier, you know, bigger, bigger and meaner bosses to uh, fight against later on. So, and maybe you'll need the mortars to uh, soften up you know, zombies that are rushing you or something like waves or something that I, I kind of see that. I don't know if that's what they're going to do, but I'll kind of lean that direction. We have power. Let's go ahead and set our coordinates to Microtech. New Babbage. I'm quite sure there's going to be some NPCs out here, and this is not my ship that's got blowed up. It's going to be stock, and I just want to get out of Dodge and get back, and we're going to hop over and poke around over there in the last town there. But yeah, if they're going to do anything, that's what I would like to see. A little more customization with your bases. I even thought at one point in time when they first had the uh, uh, crater open that you were going to be able to somehow have like a, a, a tunnel from your base to the crater using like one of those uh, portable, uh, like that, that rail system. I thought they was going to have that set up because when they showed the, uh, like an excavation machine down there with a forklift, uh, it kind of gave it an idea that, okay, you're going to be taking, repair the fort, the excavation, excavation, the drilling machine and drill your, drill a tunnel back to your base and, uh, have that as a way to get back and forth from the crater to your base even faster. But then they went in a different direction as far as what it seemed like they were teasing. All right, so it is operational. There's my ship that was blowed up. We're going to try and get out of here with the quickness. We'll probably get targeted already. And there is a ship nearby. Blue marker. Well, that's mine. There's nothing on it. I don't know why it's showing like it's been uh, been occupied. That's funny. I feel like you place some mortar down in a location, then you hit it with bombs and snipe zombies with it. Can't move unless you pick it up and take it to a new location. Yeah. No craters. May it fell off so fast. Yeah. I say you would play the, you could play the creator if they actually, you know, gave it a purpose to benefit something over in your single player game. That's the only reason I would want them to do that. Well, I said they've done so much now that they can change what it could have been that it doesn't even matter now. I mean, they could always take and just flip it and say, oh, put some story, you know, have some story to take and rec to change the direction that they had it set up for. But yeah, you know, they had a, an opportunity to, uh, have a completely different storyline for us to crater and actually have it uh, be meaningful to the single player uh, experience. Because right now it's not. That's the biggest problem. Didn't have any uh, purpose for anybody to go over there at all now. But if they had done it, instead of it being this closed off separate area it would have been great because it explained everything you know meteor hits alien virus wipes out most of earth transforms a few things but at least it would have more context than what they do now it all goes back to a virus so that would have even been cooler to have the 
you know, we had to take and build this wall that they originally tried to uh, contain it behind the, that wall and uh, it still got out. But you can find ways like the early ones that ground zero, so to speak, that survived were able to take in and find some stuff that can help you turn the tide. So that's what I was kind of hoping they were going to do. That, that would have made all the sense in the world. Off the drone and give it a turret. Now, have you seen all the mods that they have planned for the drone? I mean, there's like 30 mods for it. You don't get that for any other thing in the game. Any of the guns don't have that many mods. But you still have to sacrifice a slot to take and keep it on you. And I don't, you know, if it is OP, that's the whole point. Because I mean, the, the blueprints are not dropping like, like candy. They can uh, make those things hard to find. So I still think it should be something you can use in conjunction with your true friend if you get one and still keep both your, your guns on you. That whole and uh, that entire thing of swapping out either gun or your med and your healing, your, your med kits to keep it. I just don't get that. But basically it does have a turret. Um, yeah, I don't need to dock anything and claim this ship. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle system. You know what? It's a funny thing. I haven't even used it that much to even, to make it vent to, to even swap out a battery on it. You know, I, I take it for the places that it takes that you have to have it, but I haven't tried anything else to see if it's actually functional. Uh, anywhere else in the game. You know, and it might be, but you know, if you're saying that the battery's not worth it, yeah, no point in trying to worry about it. All right, give me a minute. I'm going to take a swap over the last day on Earth. It'll be about five, ten minutes at the most. I'll be right back.
Yeah, I had to take an, uh, well, I had to take an update 
all the other sites on multi-stream and I'm on Facebook, Twitch, Rumble, Provo, Kick, DLive. So I had to go and update the titles and uh, categories on all of them. It takes a minute to type all that in because the service that I'm using Restream, even though it has this uh, ability to do that on one area, it doesn't always update all of them. So I have to manually go and check all them all, which I said takes a minute. Be live. I don't even bother with it. There's nobody over there. In fact, I told myself I was not going to be streaming over there anymore. Anyway, we are back on last day on Earth. So let's do the laboratory again. Like I say, you're going to have to take a farm this stuff, and I don't know what we're going to need next. But uh, until they take and add the um, next resource that we're going to need. will be this puppy right here, Tungsten. Whenever they add that, that'll add this, 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 and that. This will be on like four. And, oh, yes, right. The repair bench. Repair station, which should have been in the game. Four updates, five updates ago. It should have been up when they came out with. Uh, Titania. But, you know, we'll see. Turn my controller on. I take and go to the, um, uh, I'm going to take a head over here to the swamp first. Swing back over here to the uh, transport hub and maybe knock out something with the lab. Let me see what I get left for these guys here for them to give me another. And we're going to find that. Let's see. Take out the. Okay, we'll do that real quick and make a full. Okay, so we'll just bypass this one because. Not find it anytime soon. Be bulls and then make a set. Don't take but a hot second on that because I should have everything to do that real quick. Head over to the farm and see what bunker, what base they give us to raid. Good one or not. Got tungsten. That's just. I'm sure if the if the um, these things are in an area that they are titanium armor suit, you just get fragments of titanium over there. I'm sure that they're going to make that tungsten whatever location, which is probably going to be the the, the uh, urban the urban location. I hope. Um, I'm going to be a pain in the butt to try and uh, get that stuff. All right, full tactical. See if they give us a good base. In fact, I may just leave this in the back of the pickup truck for now until you can, the NPCs can start breaking down steel walls and they can carry this back with them maybe get a revenge raid at the same time all right so all right that's that that and we're just gonna go take out the zombies no, take one second what's better three layers of stone walls or one layer of one layer of steel walls all day for now like i said until they put it where uh Because even though that zombie horde, they can break down. No, no, I'll take that back. For now, for the the for the biggest problem is going to be zombies, and you need the stone wall to keep them from tearing it down. But the NPCs will use dynamite on your stone walls. And I know Star Snipe 
uh, talks about making like a one by one, you know, every, every spot you go, it's just one, one circle, which gets to be tedious, uh, trying to move through all the doors and all that. Uh, that's pretty much the only way I can think of that. He's had it and he's talked about, um, building a, a, a base that's fairly cheap and affordable. So yeah, I should have enough for the farm. Yeah. Yeah, here. Yeah, I'll do the three layers of stone walls. If you, once you can get to steel, that'll keep your base to be pretty much raid proof. And uh, zombies can't do any damage to it at that point in time. Like I said, until they take and change the. Uh, what they can do. Like I said, I just hope by the end of the year that this is not the only things that we're looking at. And I hope we have more than just this as a permanent location at it. I want to be able to go here. I want to be able to go here. And if, if this is supposed to be leading into the city, you know, they could have a bigger location out here somewhere. We'll see. Yeah. Right about that, Jeff. So a lot of times you get your base, just make sure you do your research on it before you, uh, oh, there's another poster. Is that the event that's going on? Start it. That should look crooked creep. I didn't bring a shotgun. Yeah, you have one in the thing, and that's this one here. I don't know what this event's the purpose of this thing is. Oh, okay. If I find that, I'll come back and grab that one. Shotgun. To have it modded. If we do one, just to do some damage with it, get credits for it. A thousand points of damage. All right, so just have to go loud with it. I like having it more silence, but we can. fix that and yeah, I still don't hear it okay that's what it is I am Jeff. I don't think there's much of a delay. Got yeah, my screens here on the scene. Be only a few of them off by a few seconds, but switching YouTube are pretty. Same delay. Yes, I am live on Twitch also. There to go. 
Just need the points. Welcome back, jokes. All right, so three more here. Oh, there you go. Don't have to spray it on this. Just trying to get. Okay, cool. That one's done. So, finish using this on this guy. Y'all just they decided to all come after me when they were fighting each other. That's funny. Alright. I thought it was cooked, but I found the part of the headphone. I don't have any mods on the shotgun. I just grabbed this out of the uh out of my uh mail because I didn't bring one over here for this. Ooh. Can't leave the turkey, can't leave the oat. So right now it's just a plain stock shotgun. And let's go after you, because I need to kill all three of you guys. I'm glad those bulls do not charge like they do would do in real life. I only have big ammo. <laughs> yeah, this is just a stock shotgun here. And make sure I have something for the. Uh... Oh, really? That's funny. These guys be coming from. They're gonna try and punch me out. That's almost insulting. Uh oh, you had a he had a machete and didn't use it. I don't understand the AI sometimes. Odds do make everything easier. Oh, this you. Oh, they reduced your health. Okay. That's cake. Care for that. I kind of miss being able to, uh, let's go away from someone that had a key now. Being able to, oh, is that, oh, I need two of these posters. Okay. So two of these, I can go and get that uh, equalizer. Got the puppy. All right, bull. Really? You're just going to walk away? It's funny, you never turned around. Wait, you know they made the... No, I didn't. I mean, I know it's a vent going on right now, but I did not know they had to reduce the health on them. He didn't drop the key, though. Yeah, I thought for sure he would have dropped the key, but it doesn't. Didn't. See, <laughs> that tells you how long I've been over here at the farm. What? That's right. I know the wire dropped over here, but since I've been working on the settlement, and if it's months ago, and what? I just start playing this back. I mean, literally at the end of last year, like December, right about the time you started playing the game. And I had been to the farm at all. Yeah, this is, uh, I think the hotel is going to be a little bit more treacherous than this right now. Let's see. Don't need that. Send all this stuff. Plus that to get full. 
Oh, that's right. I didn't take it, clean it out. Great. Now I'm not getting around these iron hatches. I'll just come back and get this stuff later. Yeah, I thought one of the, uh, thought one of the, um, Ops dropped the key. This is probably the third time I've been over here. It's like, I just don't, there's just really nothing here for the, there's nothing unique. Basically they say there's nothing unique. Yeah, you ain't kidding about them reducing the health on these things. That's anticlimactic. I kind of wish that they did take and charge you. Like if you got them down to 10% health, you got to make sure you had your, had them a barrier between you and them and they charged a barrier. And one more. The other one, that, he's over here. So basically you just do all this with melee weapons. Hmm. Yeah, I, people have been saying that for years. I don't, you know, that would be that would be appropriate to uh, get a chunk of meat out of them. Ten stack would be because of what they raised the deer to three. Deer used to only give you one. Now the deer give you three. It would make all the sense in the world for these bulls to give you a stack of ten. I never, I haven't used this before. Let's see what this will do. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, that's nice. That is nice. Nah, they're gonna give you a thousand steel bars, but the, the stack of 10 or 20 meat for a bull, yeah, that makes all the sense in the world. Make it something, make it a something you want to go take out for the reward. But me, all right, I'll keep that. And now let's go see what's behind. I do miss the fact that you used to have it where it was a chance of this guy's busting open. You don't get the, you don't get the. You don't get the swarm of zombies no more. Maybe you do. Yep, there are your engine parts. There's a wheel. Okay, so they still come around. Do 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 do. I took and ripped all my gear off. All right, so you still get the chopper wheel, engine part. So farm still, and what do we have from the chest? Ugh. All right, I'll I'll take the um, M16 as a constellation. Really don't care for this thing, although it does a lot of damage. Since we have no gear, let's just throw this on for now. Hmm. When is this one? That's a gunsmith. Okay. Yeah. Like I said, I know they, I remember they made the chopper easier for people to get years ago. I remember that part. There's just no way you can have people just running everywhere. That's why I said they just should have got rid of the energy requirement. 
And people still would have got the chopper because you still you can haul more things in the back of it. Since the main goal of this game is storing up loot. Loot and store it up. That's pretty much it. What am I doing? Out of here. You know, I forgot about that. What would be the point of the horses like me? 200 more energy you can wrap. Yeah, you know what? You're right. I don't know what the. That's a good question because they've left that saddle in here still. I thought they was going to get rid of it. And it's going to require tungsten. I'm like, why? Telling me I forgot about the horse being in game. I guess it's in game. But it's going to come along with the repairing and do, 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 do all this plus the helicopter. Don't get it. You know, this right here is just going to so you can put it on the ground, whatever. 25. 20 of these. That's going to be a grind. I'm sure they're going to make that difficult to get this stuff. You already got this stored up. You good, but that's going to probably gonna be the one's going to hold you up. And that'll be the first layer. And then the second layer is going to be everything else you're going to need. Yep. Unless, unless the horse is going to be, they're going to have a location. You're going to only get there by horse. Like maybe, I don't know, up here. We make some kind of mountainous area up here. You can only traverse it. Like it's going to be too windy for a helicopter. So you'll have to get over here somehow and then take a horse and you can only bring so much back. It's just going to be just great. It's going to be awesome. If that's going to be the type of grind that they're going to take and come up with. And I say that sarcastically. race you still get this is another underrated most dangerous location yeah are you right on the table or is it inside in here on this wall it's in here yeah horses race would be fun betting twin guns for a chance to win you know that that right there is a that is a very good idea that would be cool to uh participate in a horse race of some sort. Maybe you got to skill your horse up to go faster or something like that. We'll upgrade your saddle. Just some fun things to uh, put some variety into the game. I mean, they, like I said, they've got the, they have the things to do it. It uh, just leave things in the game. I have you know, chat. I choose Winchester Cleaver or Three Springs. I don't think they're gonna make it a location again. Greater Wall used to be a location. Yeah, see, that's why. I, that's what I said. I wish they kept that because I fixed that interface to components over there to fix it, and it was a lot. And it just got tossed aside. Um, say, what's your question, Kent? I have something. I choose Winchester Cleaver or Three Springs. Springs are pretty easy to come by with the recycler. What's the Winchester Cleaver? 
So like I should know what your is that a component? You know, gun piece or something? Cause I'm not a fan of the Winchester. Winchester Cleaver. Charcoal. Oh, I found in one grenade. Oh, that's funny. That's just fun to do. All right, Weeper. Oh, you're going to be a two shot. Get wrecked. How you say it? Get wrecked. <laughs> All right. Out here. And this is the one that you will usually have. Hmm. Oh, yeah, I could. Oh, did I bring anything? Oh, I did. Care for the bat. Guys, come a little closer. This is more like the door. Oh, the worst spot to do this. Still work. I'll right, open that one. Open that one. Gun oil. Gun oil. Bunker. Alpha. Yeah. Bunker alpha. Hard mode. I open this? I did not. Yeah. Wasn't ready for the rollout. I like the echo sound that it does off in the distance. And remember, Bravo gives you. Bravo is not worth it trying to get gun on because you just lose all your guns. Let's get the vent going on. But Alpha for sure.
Mm -hmm. There we go. And it's only one of you guys popping out of there. Key wiki. Spear is coming soon. I am not that brave. I have to take and watch you guys smiles, watch this video and do a few off off stream practice runs. And then use it when it's quote unquote nerfed. Probably even do Bravo with melee. You're just gonna have to die a lot of times in Doctor Dread. And uh, yeah, that's uh, <laughs> that's a tall challenge right there. Doors locked. while you're down here uh, so okay that's not meant to be broken I guess keep seeing that I'm thinking one day you probably use C4 or something like to some other location in there yeah. I guess there's all of this Shortcut back. I got time to do the transport hub. Take and call it work tomorrow. Let's see. We will put this here. Probably second floor is so easy for the amount of carbon you can get. Yeah, it is. It is pretty easy. And uh, just getting the mechanics on the boss right. Got to dread. Third floor is actually, to me, is easy. Well, you got the first floor, third floor. They're both pretty easy. And the boss fights. Dread is about the only one that'll jack you up if you make a mental mistake. Get out of position, as they say. Well, you should go check it out next time um, it comes up on the calendar because they're going to reduce the health of those guys. Um, you should go ahead and check. You should go ahead and do it. At least it'll be much, much easier because they're not going to hit as hard. And that's the time if you've never been in there and they got it where their health is less and they don't do as much damage. That's when you want to go in there and try and clear it out. But 
Like I said, the only problem is you don't get any weapons out of there. It chews all your weapons up. And like Joke says, if you get used to uh, get good at wall tricking, uh, it'll save you a lot of headaches on your weapons. But outside of that, you're definitely going to need uh, to have that event up to help you out. Especially if you don't have enough mods to uh, make up the difference in damage and all that. I want to know what am I looking for? This in here. Heal for sure, especially if we all, especially if the only one we get is the uh, butcher. Need some armor piercing for explosives and the uh, ride zombies. I could not think of these guns earlier. Where are they? These scars. Two scars. I'll take a third one. And a third one. They are for the miner if he decides to show up the butcher don't really need it for the butcher butcher is like easy mode if you always do the alpha third and second floor every reset you get three guns and sometimes seven and those seven guns are pretty good for spears and for food yep carrot wall trick with pistols spitters are the boss <laughs> the spitters yes they are Spitters and the, and the, and the uh, melters, they are the their own category of dangerous. Of course, now if you were going in there with no armor, they're no big deal then. Yes, I agree. Nerf garage shield zombies at zero guns. You don't have any guns. Let me think. If you've not done bunker alpha. You'd have to go in there and try to do it with just uh, melee. Other than that, your only option is the motorcycle event, and hopefully they'll drop you a pistol or a shotgun. Uh, the farm, you can. That's kind of kind of a challenge to melee it until you get the mechanics on that. There's no real wall trick in there at the farm. Just in general. And those raiders are bum Russia with their guns. And that's kind of, hmm. Try to think that's a bit of a tall order. I'm trying to think, where did I start at? Because I know I didn't go to the bunker right off the bat. I think I kept doing the farm and the motorcycle events. See whatever dropped with melee weapons. Oh, that's right. Zip guns. I was telling jokes. I, I used a lot of zip guns early on that I could make. Got the mods for them. All right. I need to throw these grenades. Yes, grenade. this here and take these all the way back here at the back. Yeah, let's see which level of supply gives slow supply gives gun oil. 
have trunky guns. I'm saving up for arena and Bravo events. The farming yellow and green zone only bring spears, no healing. See, the red force used to be good for having a shotgun or a pistol in the red chest over there because it was such a dangerous chance of having the big one. And uh, they got rid of it. There was another place I forgot. I used to take and, uh, go there for wood and you just come out with two guns sometimes. Either they be half durability, but it's still could use them. They don't, they got rid of the red force. Red zones, you can be like maybe cleavers. Yeah. Again, no heels armor. I fully modded cleaver. Oh, if you got fully modded cleavers. Yeah. You got fully modded cleavers. You can do some damage. Because even though. Um, machetes are good. It's just getting the steel bars to. Consistently be able to use them. Or to make them until you get the stockpile of uh, iron ore or iron bars uh, stored up. I have a mod for cleaver, and it's not really good. It's a handle mod. Yeah, like I say, the more you, the longer you play it, though, yeah, no choice. This thing's gonna crash on me again. I could use that, but no, it's gonna crash. What do we have? Let me see if this base is any good that he's gonna give us. Break out my search research tool. Of the big one. Go. Gonna be all iron conjunction. The four. This would stay all the place. The metal. video is three minutes long I don't think there's going to be a lot in this one wait 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 we found some pistols that's a minigun and pistols yes Don't 
for that because there's some pistols on here and I don't think the VSS and the minigun he brought with him. And he didn't have to use a C4, does he? Nope. It's, oh, it's got a boatload of no tickets. Uh, so straight forward. Where you went. It's the same base. Just past that. All right. See if this stuff is still here. I'm gonna leave this here because I don't need all of that. That's the wrong balance to bring for this. Also, uh Jeff, uh getting raids, man. You never know. You can I've had some raids in the past where I would have 30 pistols and it was just, you know, you'd be stopped for about a month on pistols because that's the base was just loaded with them. So that's another thing. And then if you get a revenge raid um, and the base just happens to be loaded up on weapons, uh, that's a bonus. So let's see. Me, these back. It is. It's definitely a gamble, that's for sure. But, like, if it pays off, uh, you'll be sitting pretty for a long, long time. Swamp pistols that are silenced. Don't want those. No shotgun. See, that should be okay. Make sure he didn't use that C4 for anything. Like he didn't need to use it at all. left it somewhere because I don't think he needed it. I said it's, it's got a there is a brick wall. Oh, he found a chest full of... I don't need armor. Okay, cool. So we're going to leave the C4. Sometimes the problem is some of these bases, there could be two versions of the same base and you won't know it till you get there. And that right there is when it really just stinks. That, that. Because I've seen double versions of, a, of the same base. And um, those are not fun. these hatches but we're going to oh wait a minute, I need this I found out after a while don't always bring your puppy on these raids because sometimes the trick where you can 
let yourself get taken out will prevent you from picking up even more loot. They'll take and kill the mobs. The one mob you want to leave alive, they'll take and take them out for you. Stack, don't need that. Hey, the hammers are gonna be something you're gonna need like 80 of them right after you get rid of them. Yeah, I've had I've seen bases, uh, uh, and I've even got some old videos, of the same base, uh, with the same name, but it's completely different layouts. Um, it's rare, but it does happen. And somebody explained it that uh, somehow they will uh, have an updated base of the same name and it gets in the system and it'd be the exact same spelling and everything. Go without guns, arm and heels, two bases of the same name. All right, need to can check the motorcycle. It's full of fuel, but I'm not going to be to do that. So he went around here, past this, and here. And we'll keep going until you see, oh, no, not that. I need you to break the chest. That's all the food. Here come all these guys. Five. Oh, to chess, my guy. And this one. Oh no, what's in this one? That's all the mess stuff. Yeah. Hate these guys are so big. And I need one of you guys to stay alive. Okay. Got the one floater bloater. Get some separation. Because I need him to stay alive. Let's wait two. I'm going to run back here. The guns do cause noise, but I've got a suppressor on these pistols, so if you don't have it, it's going to be way too loud. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? There was a C4 that you needed here? But I did not see him use it. I don't know what to do. do 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 Out. I 
Oh man, he put all these. That's funny. So I know what he did with the one C4. Now I'll just come back and punch this guy up when I run that stuff back because the guns are behind the other wall in there. Yep. I wish there were some spikes here. Mm -mm -mm. Spikes makes it a little easier, even quicker, actually. Now, I don't think I went down the wrong side. I could have. That'd be on me. Because it's got a few guns, pistols. It's mainly the, the yellow tickets that I want to grab. Let me go get this one C4. There's yellow tickets, green tickets. They turn into guns also. Oh, that's another thing, Jeff, is you, while you're clearing locations and stuff, and if you get free tickets, always collect those tickets. Because that's an that's a easier way of uh, you don't have to do the bunker that way. Sometimes you just save up tickets over time, and uh, you ready to go in there and start turning them in for chess. Now and then it glitches where it won't, it won't let you get out of your bike. I don't know what that's about. All right, let's see if we did this right. If not, Oh, well, we'll just take as much as we can before the uh, enforcer arrives and says, you've got to go now. <laughs> I know. That would have been really bad. Oh. Take this real quick. No, not that. That chest that had a loom. And then it's a chest here. And they had all the food. All right, we don't want that. Set a C4 here. And hope this pays out. Alright, so should be the last wave. to be efficient now there's the wall this should open this chest up here and bada bing bada boom and there's your VSS there's your minigun K47 and uh, we're not gonna make any take any chances we're gonna roll these puppies back to the motorcycle
and keep one just so we have to shoot our way out as the thing I'm after now would be the tickets and there's a few pistols but that'll be all we can get out of here at that point you're right I don't want to get stuck on like this narrow one way now he went this way is that my last iron hatchet oh you gotta be kidding me Bro. Well, that'll be it for this then. Wow. Wait a minute, hold on. Maybe not. Tools. It's not over yet. Alright, there's the ATV. And he right behind it 86 95 oh this is gonna hurt Let's see what's here all right empty that one so one two so maybe grab and run Yep. Yep, yep. Do 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 do. Because I don't need the. Yep, I missed the three pistols. Did you see it? Hold on. Uh... don't think I can if I had the you know but that room set up I can't even set it up where I can keep him out yeah I'm about to let that one go the guns were probably in that same chest although I hit I did take in uh try to grab all the tickets so I didn't want these though I did get all the yellow tickets though so that's one, two, three, four, five, six. Minus one. That would be seven yellow chests to open up at the bunker. And the yellow chests are pretty good at having at least two to three. No. Usually two. Sometimes you might get a third melee weapon in there. You can open those up every time the base uh, resets. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Hey fellas, <laughs> 12 guns from those yellow tickets. Yep. Yep. That's the part right there. Uh, if, if that base was set differently where you can take in, get your motorcycle in there and block it off, I would have tried it. Block off the section where they can't get to you. I'll go about, I got the video up here still, so I want to see what I missed out on. Because he apparently, this person's video, they found four sets of, no, five sets of police gear too. Somebody that grabbed that out of there also. But you know, I'll take it. Yeah, that's a lot of tickets. Yellow and red. Green sometime, but most definitely won't take the yellow tickets. You get that many of them. That's a consolation for me. That's uh, like you said, that's 12 guns. Oh, yeah. But I'm about to call after that. That's three hours. I got to get up in the morning and uh, hopefully 
you guys are here tomorrow night i might get like an hour and a half in something like that trying to uh, finish grinding out the laboratory and uh transport hub get ready for us uh, the next season which is going to be right around the corner since they've already showed us the shogun type gear that we're going to get um pretty exciting i hope it's all going to be tied into a continuation of the survivor's pass where are you at you're I mean, not here anymore but um that's why I keep missing it. I hope it's a continuation to this. Yeah, or even continue the other story mode with the settlement. Which, uh, I'm sure it's going to be part two to that. So I'll be doing that chopper trick when I start raiding. What's your bike style? Uh, mm. I got quite a few. Then there's some I don't have. Then there's some I wish I could get rid of. Like all oh, these are ones I don't have yet. I just say they're just random. This is one I've been trying to get ever since season ten. And picked it up yet. Uh, so these are the ones I don't have, but everything else I pretty much have. Well, all these I don't have. Probably half and half. I would say of uh What they've got the one I like the most outside the one I'm using now is the uh, green version of it. This one, Thanos. So I like the trikes too. They're pretty, they're pretty cool. Snow bikes. I wish these things. I wish they made a perk that these would run faster in the snow areas. Uh, I think that would be that would be a attraction for using these if you're going up north in those snow those snow wooded areas the uh, frozen zombies if these gave you a speed burst a speed boost only in the snow areas so anyway pretty much I like oh the Leviathan I like that one too anyway folks uh, Jeff Danny Bugs. Anyone else is lurking on any other platforms? Thank you guys for stopping in, chatting, lurking, just uh, checking out, and I uh, really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, we will catch you guys. I say hopefully tomorrow, probably a little shorter during the week because I'm back to work, been on vacation this week. So be on the back end of my uh, work schedule, uh, try and keep this up until then, some actual content going to be out there so guys have a great day morning afternoon evening uh whatever part of the world you're at guys be awesome all right to the next one